Introducing the Clash Royale Earthquake. At tournament standard, it accumulatively does 183 tower damage over the course of 3 seconds. It can fully counter any basic bait card like a Goblin Gang or Skarmie without any issues. However, it cannot shoot up so you're not going to be able to use it against any type of minions or bats. Furthermore, in addition to its area damage, it slows down any unit or building. Notice how the Expo attacks way slower after the Earthquake is casted on it. For a plus one elixir trade, it can actually deny all but two hits from a mortar. So that means you only really need to tank for two of the mortar hits and then you can fully deny it with an Earthquake. In my opinion, the Earthquake will be best with the Miner. The Earthquake will provide area denial so no squishy bait units will ever be able to get on top of the Miner, they'll just simply die, and it will slow down any units dropped to kill the Miner and the Tower, so the Miner will get extra hits. I can also envision the Earthquake working pretty well with a Ram Rider or a Hog Rider to allow it safe passageway towards the tower. I think that the Earthquake is going to be a massive nerf to any Siege deck. It's going to slow down buildings, the tower, and it's just going to allow the Miner to chip away on top of the Expo or the Mortar so quickly. Heck, if you want to play greedy because Earthquake is such a hard counter, you can actually go and Miner on top of the tower, ignoring the Mortar or the Expo, and a lot of times they'll drop squishy bait units, whether it's Skeletons with 2.9 or Goblin Gang with Mortar, right into the Earthquake, because a lot of times you'll be dropping the Miner right on top of the Expo or the Mortar, and then they'll predict that. Unlike the Tornado, the Earthquake has enough damage to fully counteract the Goblin Barrel without aid from your tower. That means if you don't have Log or Barb Barrel in hand, and if your opponent ends up going in for a Goblin Barrel with a tank, you can end up using the Earthquake to counteract the Goblin Barrel. Overall, I love the concept of the Earthquake card, but I think it might actually be a little bit strong with Miner, especially against Siege decks, and it will definitely be a great way to combat bait. So let me know down below in the comment section what you guys think of the card. I personally can't wait to test it out in the arena. This new update is going to be absolutely amazing, and I can't wait to see you guys in the arena. So thanks for watching, thanks for chilling with me, and I'll see you guys next time.